ancient Egypt thousands of years ago. Back then, they called kings and queens pharaohs. What are those triangle-shaped buildings? They're called pyramids. Inside, they had secret rooms and hidden treasure. Even mummies. <laughs> mummies? <laughs> Don't worry, Orbit. They're not like mummies you see in the movies. Egyptian mummies aren't scary at all. As much as I love reading about ancient Egypt, wouldn't it be fun to explore a real pyramid and see what's inside? Oh, that sounds like a mission. You know what that means. It's time for us to pick a planet.
I've got an idea. We can pretend to be a mummy and surprise Emma. This is so exciting. What if we find a mummy? <laughs> story on the wall. I'll be Queen Cleopatra, and Orbit can be the mummy. Uh huh? Okay, fine. You can play the mummy, TK. No need to get upset. Um, Emma? That wasn't me. If it wasn't you, who was it? The mummy! <laughs> Don't be silly, Orbit. It's probably just the wind. <laughs> Besides, mummies aren't scary, remember? Took it too far. I'm sorry. It's okay. No problem. Yeah, what they said. After all, we never would have found this room if it weren't for you, and I never would have seen a real mummy. I'd say this is another.
fun to pretend to be a mummy, but I ended up really scaring everyone, which isn't fun at all. That's a lesson worth learning. Now, time to go. Get ready for countdown. for 
So you don't waste your wish. I wish I had super speed like my hero Robomax! should loosen him up. Mission 
control? Hi, Rob. You're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? <laughs> well, we went to the Wish Planet so we could each make a wish. But our wishes only caused trouble. First, Orbit couldn't stop. And then he couldn't go. And Emma couldn't stop dancing. Then I wish we'd never had any wishes. And everything went back to normal. I think we all learned that we need to be careful what we wish for and to be happy with what we have. Wonderful lessons to remember, Rob. Well done. I guess that's mission accomplished. Let's go home. Better buckle up. Five, four, three, two, one. Yay! Goodbye, Wish Planet.
look, you need a magic wand to do these tricks. Of course, that makes sense. But the magic kit didn't come with any wands. Don't worry, I think I can help with that. Hmm, no, a feather duster? <laughs> That's not right. Hmm. Aha, a spoon! Hmm, that's not a wand. Let's see if it works. into a rabbit. At least he reappeared. How do we fix him? Oh, I don't know. You mean Squeak is gonna be a bunny forever? Maybe the book. Wait, Squeak.
book had to know the magic words. Magic is really just knowing how. That's the trick. Yay! I think this is a big mission accomplished. Mission control? Yes, Rob, you're back. So, what did you learn on your mission?
rock like that before. <laughs> <sighs> okay, Rob. We're ready. We all found something really cool for show and share. So did I. <laughs> but it's just a rock. Ooh. Yeah, but it has stripes and a hole right through the middle. Neat, huh? Does it do anything? I don't think so. It's just a rock. That's what I said. There are tons more interesting things around here than a rock. Yeah, like what I found. What is it? It's a radio, I think. It plays music. Let me show you.
Well, it sure feels like a rock. And it's hard like a rock. Ooh. It smells like a rock, too. Yuck! Here, Emma. Cat! <laughs> <laughs> that didn't sound like a rock. Which means, mission accomplished! Mission control? Hi, Rob, you're back. So, what did you learn on your mission? <laughs> well, we came to Discovery Planet to find new things for show and share. But we discovered that nothing we found was what we thought it was. TK's radio didn't play music like she thought. It made loud noises. And Emma's pogo stick was really a whirling stick. And Orbit's flying saucer was really a rolling saucer. Finally, we discovered that the rock I found wasn't just a rock. It also made awesome sounding space music. So we learned that things aren't always what they seem to be. Well done. I think it's time to go. Better buckle up. Five. 